Let's compare these two fractions. We have 1 8 and 2 tenths. So we want to know which one is larger. So to do that, we could just divide 1 by 8 in a calculator, 2 by 10 in a calculator, and you'd see the decimals there, and you could just compare them, figure out if 1 8 is larger than, equal to, or less than 2 tenths. So why don't we do this, though? Why don't we find a common denominator? I know that 8 times 5, that equals 40. And then down here, I could have 10 times 4. That would equal 40 as well. So now I have the same denominator. I could just compare the numerators. I can't just multiply the denominator here by 4, though. I need to also multiply the numerator by 4. 4 over 4, that's just 1. So I'm just multiplying by 1. I'm not going to change the value. 2 times 4 is 8. And 8 fortieths, that is an equivalent fraction to 2 tenths. Up here, let's multiply the numerator by 4. 5, and now we get 5 fortieths. Since these are the same, we're just going to compare the numerators. 8 is larger than 5, so 8 fortieths is larger than 5 fortieths by 3 fortieths. And since these are equivalent here and here, we can say that 2 tenths is larger than 1 eighth. And note, we could have simplified this down to 1 fifth and done the same thing, but this works pretty well. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.